to stay with Miss Alice. What? Did you forget? Orson Wilde, you know, the star of American theatre. And he's visiting and staying with us. You did forget? No, no, not, not that. I, I meant you wanting to stay with Miss Alice. Yes, that's right. Miss Alice suggested it. She told me you couldn't possibly refuse. I mean, I could refuse, but... Take a fan. I guess it. I guess it doesn't matter. Why don't you stay with Mrs. Hudson? Oh, but Miss Caitlin has more in common with Miss Alice, and they get along so well. Guess what, Mrs. Hudson? Mr. Wilde is here to study my father's character for his next play, and he won't be disappointed, will he? Father is so pig-headed. I can't believe it. The great Sherlock Holmes standing in front of me. I'm sure that our two brains will. Brains. 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 Sir? Alright. Oh, God, I hate his mustache already. He looks like an asshole. Is I saw something sickly. Uh. American pride, American woman. Go down, buddy. Let's, oh, <laughs> forgot to say something. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Tony Nice. I'm playing video games. This is case three. That is how we're gonna start. Sorry about that. I got totally distracted. I was like, oh yeah, wait, I forgot. We are doing this alive. Um, but anyways, we might finish, might start this live, but we may not finish this live. We might finish this with a, um, voiceover. We'll see how fast I work. Which is not that fast. You know me, I'm kind of slow. But anyways, um, let me go ahead and finish this and then I'll give a proper intro. It's being rude. Where in the hell? Of the fence. Oh. 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 I don't know. I mean, this is—he's an American. It would make sense of self-defense, right? Self-afflicted, not self-defense. Why I say self-defense? Self-afflicted. Sorry. Um. Did I get them all? I got them all. Okay, good. Good. Yeah, Damn, this me forever. Mr. Wild, your room. Charming. <laughs> this is such a fascinating city. We need to talk. I'd rather not. You're going to be angry 
again. Goodbye, Mr. Wild. Is it five o'clock already? I think I might go and ask Mrs. Hudson for some tea. <laughs> I don't like him. I, I don't like him at all. Anyways, what is up, guys? Oh, welcome back to my channel. It has been a minute. Since I talked to you guys, because last time I was here, I was doing case two, and yeah, case two kind of just honestly um, made me kind of just, I don't know, it was a daily and it kind of was like, ugh, I didn't want to play any this game <laughs> after that. But, um, so I started doing some other things. I started doing just... Oh, Wild's already making himself at home. Talking about, um... Talking, made my new series of my wrestling. Talking about wrestling and stuff like that. But, yeah, I just... I, I needed a little bit of break. So, I did some other stuff. Instead... Oh, you hear the kids playing outside. Nice. Anyways, so yeah. But then, I was like, you know what? I kind of missed this place, so... While Trudy has a perfect disguise kit, do I just really need all this? I mean, he's an actor. This must be grease paint. So, yeah, but anyways, I just like decided not to do anything. So I was like, oh god. Oh, face powder of an excellent quality. Dude, we are like this being all kinds of nosy, dude. All kinds of nosiness right now. We just pick up the pin for no reason. Can't be. Can't be. There has to be a reason. Don't know what that reason is, but there must be one. Oh, wait. Uh, maybe I thought I saw something. I thought I saw a put a cat. I did. I did. But yeah, anyway, so that, that last game was a jelly. But we're at a new game now and um this is i believe called infamy hopefully it won't be as i use the same brushes for makeup oh nice you guys how much in common i forgot my hat father i'm just checking um you've got something on your face is it makeup uh it might be i Practicing my disguises, you know me. <sighs> no, don't, don't touch that! No, no! Ah, uh, wow. <laughs> ah, Mrs. Hudson, with our team. Not yes, quite. The we have tea. a visitor. However, the lady is not so much angry as perplexed. Good day to you, gentlemen. My name is Mary Sutherland. I have come to you, Mr. Holmes, because I would give everything I have to know what has become of Mr. Hosmer Angel. Why the haste, Miss Sutherland? Mr. Hosmer Angel has disappeared, and my father, Mr. Winterbank, will do nothing. It makes me so angry. Oh, does it? Does it really make you angry? I'm sorry.
Alright, let's check my thing out. I'm just profiling everybody today, ain't I? Just all profiles. Oh, I know that I wear glasses. I'm not white, but, you know, I know about the, the whole. Let's see. She's rich, bitch. Um. Creepy, dude. Do anybody else find this creepy who play this game? Then you have to go and check them out. Or is it just me? Might just be me. It's like, it's part of the game. Why do you feel creepy about it? I don't know. We just do, dude. We just do. So what's been up, guys? What's been going on? How's it going? No, I, you know, nothing's been going on. Just been talking about wrestling, putting stuff, putting a model together. I put, it, I didn't put it on, like what I was doing, but I put um a gift, not a gift, a short. Why say gift? A gift about it on my, well, you know. YouTube channel where you put the shorts at, you know. You know. Oh, I need one more. Uno más. Where did my thing go? Oh, there it is. And... Is that it? Looks like that's it. Let's put it on my hand in the notebook. Mr. Windybank is your stepfather, surely, since the name is different. Well, indeed, I call him father. Although he is barely older than myself. And your mother is alive? Oh yes. Although I wasn't best pleased when she married again, and so soon after father's death, and to a man so much younger than herself. How is she a crewer? Can't help mom for that. With Mr. Hosma Angel. I met him at the Gasfitters Ball. Mr. Winderbank did not wish for me a mother to attend. He never did wish us to go anywhere, but this time I was quite set on it. Fortunately, he left for France upon some business, and so didn't have any say in it. And I met Mr. Angel that night. We met again after that and would take walks together. But then father returned, and we could no longer meet. No, oh, tragic. Why was your stepfather against your going anywhere? Well, he didn't like anything of that sort. He used to say that a woman should be happy in her own family circle. Oh, he one of those kind of people? Did Mr. Hosma Angel make no attempt to see you? Well, Father was going off again in the week. And Hosma wrote and said that it would be better for us not to see each other until Father had gone. After that, he stopped writing. Where does Mr. Angel live? I don't know exactly. I address all of his letters to the Leadenhall Street Post Office for collection. Were you engaged? Oh yes, Mr. Holmes. Right after the first walk that we took. With no time. Do you have your own income? 
I do, from an inheritance. It was left to me by my Uncle Ned in Auckland. Then you have all that you could wish for, naturally. Well, I live at home, and don't wish to be a burden to my family, so they have the use of the money. Is there anything else that you can tell me about Mr. Andrew? He's a very shy man. He would rather walk with me in the evening, so as to be discreet. I put a missing persons notice in last Saturday's Chronicle. Here's a copy, and a letter from him. Ha <laughs> ha, a love letter. Hmm, yes, I see. As I anticipated, this validates my deductions perfectly. What deductions, Mr... Mr. Wilde. Holmes, tell her. Tell her what? You're a nuisance? I think she real life this. <sighs> what a pain in my ass, dude. Seriously. Okay. What's so strange about a typewritten love letter? Is it this one I'm supposed to, or is it the other one? I keep forgetting which one it is. This one? This one. Fairly common ink, nothing special. Osmer Angel decided not to leave his signature. Wonderful time together, didn't we? While your father was in France. Ooh. Hell yeah, we had a great time. Wink, wink, wink. Uh -huh. I'm waiting for the moment when your stepfather leaves once more. Miss Sutherland only met with Hosmer Angel while the stepfather was absent. I mean. Yeah? Wouldn't you? Now what? Shut up, Toby. Making way too much noise. Good quality paper, that's me. Let's study this letter more closely. There are some letters with typographical defects. Miss Sutherland, do you have any other letters from Mr. Angel? Unfortunately not. But I brought my father's letter from Paris. Here it is. Oh, good. More letters. We can just look through more letters because we don't get to look through enough letters here. This is fantastic. Yeah, great. The stepfather's letter is also typewritten. Are they the same person? Or is this just a coincidence they did, like, typing you know could be a coincidence mm, I hope it'll be a good girl. Mm. take my advice stay at home miss Sutherland's stepfather's signature the stepfather is trying to keep the daughter at home It was him all to herself, himself, whatever. You're mine! Oh, mine! You're mine, oh, mine. I want you all to myself. I don't want to do this anymore. Fairly common ink, nothing special. I mean, yeah, we know this way. 
Toby! Stop fucking whining. Let's study this letter more closely. Do we have to? Let's study it closer. There are some letters with typographical defects. Both letters have typographical defects. I'm telling you the same person. This letter has a defect. Yeah. And it's the same letter with the same defect in both instances. Yeah. It's like they got something in common or something. Oh, I gotta find another letter. It has a defect. One more letter with a defect. All right. Oh, another that's... letter match with the same defects. How many letters do I have to find? I gotta go find another letter. God. Okay. Affected. No, the K is affected. One more letter with a defect. A. Alright, is that an A? I think that's an A. Let's see, here, let's find an A, or E, or whatever the fucking hell that letter was, I have no idea, it was defected. Uh, you know what, Toby, I'm, I'm going to throw you outside. Shut up, Toby. Shut up. Do it! Do it! Stop whining! Look what you did. You made the other dogs upset. Now they're barking. Another letter match with the same defects. So, based on the specific defects, we could say that these letters were composed on the same typewriter. I mean, we could say it. <laughs> now what? No. I'm already doing the the, the, the thing. Oh, okay, cool. Sure, why not? Whatever. Big boo boo. Okay, um, wow. Is that it? Okay, well, let's see. Um, which one should I choose? <laughs> Alright, so I can either tell her the truth or hide it. Um,.
I'm gonna tell her the truth. Cause that is just weird. Which one's X? Okay. And, and that was it, man. I'm gonna be like, okay, well, we finished. <laughs> you should try to let Mr. Hosmer Angel vanish from your memory as he has done from your life. Then you don't think I'll see him again? I fear not. Then what has happened to him? Your stepfather married your mother for her money and also enjoyed the use of your income. But with your personal advantages, it was clear that you would not remain single for long, even with him keeping you at home. He disguised himself and reappeared as Mr. Hosmer Angel. He brought you as far as the church door and then conveniently slipped away. To bring you to this conclusion in such a dramatic manner that it would leave a permanent impression upon your mind. You have been cruelly tricked, Miss Sutherland. <laughs> You've been catfished! Hey, Mr. Holmes! <laughs> no, I, I, I can't believe it! But we were engaged! Oh, it's horrible to think about! But, uh, thank you for all you have done, Mr. Holmes. Holmes! It could have been more diplomatic. Nah. I didn't want to be. I I guess. Is that it? That can't be it. I mean, sure. I mean, I don't know. What's going on? Um. All right, guys. I think that was just a little mini case that you had to do in between. I don't. I think I'm done. So yeah. I'll probably put out, start with four, um, case four tomorrow, but until then, I will see you guys next time, okay, bye!